Hi, everyone. It's great to be doing the children's message again and to be part of Children's Church. And so today, helping me are Rosie and Nora. Say hi to everyone, girls. Hi. Good. I hope that some of you watching, and you guys too, were able to do some of the activities and the Advent packages sent out. So today, we're going to be using, and actually every week through Advent, we're going to be using the wreath that uh, was part of the packages. We made that wreath at home. That's good. And um, who remembers what candle we lit last week? Hope. Right, hope. And you remember how last week Mrs. Stivey talked about hope and how Jesus brings hope and how we can help bring hope as well, uh, like by sending Christmas cards, right? So today, we are going to light the candle of peace and talk about how Jesus brings peace. Great. I'm happy that Jesus brings peace because I lost my puzzle piece. I was making a really nice puzzle. When I got to the end, I saw that a piece was missing. I remember it was a little blue corner. It would be great to have that piece. <laughs> Sorry. Jesus doesn't bring that kind of piece. He doesn't bring puzzle pieces. Too bad. How about a piece of pizza? I'm hungry. Sorry. Jesus brings a different piece. Oh, I know now. Jesus brings peace and quiet. Sometimes our house gets really noisy. Lots of talking, playing, barking, and music. Sometimes it's really noisy. I can't even think sometimes because it's so noisy. <laughs> I know that feeling. Sometimes my house gets really noisy too. <laughs> but it's a different kind of peace that Jesus brings. Listen to what the Bible says. This is a verse from the Bible. I leave with you. I Peace I leave with you. My peace I give you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your heart be troubled. Do not be afraid. There's another word for the kind of peace that Jesus brings. It's shalom. Can you guys say that? Shalom. Right. That's the kind of peace that includes your whole body and your whole mind. And it just brings a peace that makes you happy with yourself and with others and the whole world. A peace where you don't need to be afraid or worried or anxious about anything. The Advent story in your calendars and in your packages this week is the story of Mary and how she found that peace, that shalom, the peace of Jesus. Let's watch that story together and see how we too can have that peace. <laughs> Amen. 
The Story of Christmas Jesus is Born. This is Mary. Hi! You see, Mary was the mother of Jesus, but before that happened, she lived in the town of Nazareth. And she was engaged to marry a man named Joseph. Hey, -o. Hi, Joseph! Ooh, got it. Mary got pregnant by the power of God. Hey, huh? Joseph didn't understand all this at first, but an angel came and told him to still take Mary as his wife. Yeah, okay. So he did as the angel said. Not long after that, the ruler of the land, Caesar Augustus, wanted to count how many people were in the land. So Caesar Augustus ordered everyone in the land to travel back to their hometowns so that they could be counted. Joseph's hometown was Bethlehem, so Mary and Joseph traveled from Nazareth all the way to Bethlehem. When they arrived in Bethlehem, they looked for a place to stay. No, I'm sorry. Oh, man. But there was no room for them. Uh, what about her? Um, okay. So they stayed in a barn, and while they were there, Mary gave birth to Jesus. Whoa. <laughs> she wrapped him snugly in the strips of cloth uh, that'll work. and laid him in a manger. Excuse me. And so the Son of God, the Savior of the world, was born in a barn in Bethlehem. Do you think it was peace and quiet in the barn where Jesus was born? No. no, the cows were mooing, the sheep were baying, all the animals were moving. It was probably noisy. Maybe it wasn't really peaceful, but I think there was shalom in that barn. A prophet long ago wrote about that little baby. He said, for to us a child is born, to us a son is given, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, and Prince, Prince of, of Peace. Jesus is the Prince of Peace for the whole world. Let's light the peace candle. Well done. Shalom, everybody. Peace. peace. Master.